only Teddy Reiner's France and Japan, creators of the sport, could boast a better haul. But in a country dominated by grassy plains where winter temperatures often drop as low as minus 20 degrees Celsius, minus 4 Fahrenheit, such success has not always come easily. In recent years, judo has flourished in the land of Genghis Khan largely thanks to the exploits of one man. Enter Tufts Heinbei Arnaden, crowned Mongolia's first ever Olympic champion at Beijing 2008, 44 years after the East Asian nation's debut at the Tokyo 1964 Games. Born into a family of nomadic herders in the Bulgan province, Naden grew up wrestling on the Great Steppe while tending to his family's livestock. He only tried judo for the first time aged 18 after seeing the Asian Championships on television. Only six years later, he was ascending the podium in the Chinese capital with an Olympic gold medal around his neck. The first thing I thought of was my parents and my coach, said Naden then. Everyone in Mongolia is celebrating my gold medal. His victory united a nation, healing a rift between feuding political parties as thousands gathered in the main square of the capital Ulaanbaatar. Legends of Judo, Yasuhiro Yamashita Legends of Judo, Masashi Ebenuma London 2012 Mongolia had finally won Olympic gold at the 11th time of asking, Mongolia was one of the 14 nations that boycotted Los Angeles in 1984, but Naden wasn't done yet. Four years later at London 2012, combining natural fortitude with the wrestling skills he'd honed at Mongolia's traditional Nadam festivals, the half-heavyweight looked set to defend his crown until disaster struck. During a semi-final encounter with South Korea's Wang Hite, Naden tore the anterior cruciate ligament in his left knee, one of the worst injuries an athlete can suffer. The reigning champion managed to get through the match and into the final. But barely able to walk let alone fight, Naden was defeated by Russia's reigning world champion Tajir Kabuleyev. Reportedly in so much pain he didn't recognize his own father, Naden was flown back to Mongolia and consigned to a wheelchair for two months. Still he had one silver and to this day, the 33-year-old is his country's only two-time Olympic medalist. Legends of Judo, Driulis Gonzalez Morales Legends of Judo, Ryo Kotani standing just 5 foot 10, Naden added a bronze medal in the heavier, plus 100 kilograms weight category at the Budapest 2017 World Championships, toppling far larger men, including Georgian star Goram Tushishvili, to reach the podium once more. Visit for more news and features his success has spurred thousands to pick up judo in his homeland and is set to inspire countless more to come.